Hi, my name is Tommy Puglia from Power BI Tips, and could, today we're going to use all the features of a Power BI report to create a goal, connect to a data point, and show all the features that's already available in a report using the filter pane. So let's create a goal here, and we're actually going to call this the Van Arsdale Sales. And I'm going to call this central. So what I'm going to do is what we always do is we're going to connect to data. And then I'll bring up our, all the reports available to us. I want to choose a report that I want to connect my actual number to. And what I normally could do before was again, showcase uh, point to any data point. In this case, I can show Van Arstel, which will show me what I'm actually applying here. But again, I can take this one step further where I'm actually going to point and select here my actual US, uh, choose USA here and hold control on my keyboard. When I hold con USA on my keyboard, I'm gonna select Van Arstel here. Now you'll notice not only did it choose that particular data point, but it's actually remembering the filter uh, the selection that I had, the interactive uh, uh, features already available in Power BI. So now I already have this feature, this filter ability available, just like you would in a normal Power BI report which gives me a unique ability to create multiple goals without having to create multiple visuals. And again, here, I'm gonna choose my revenue year to date, year over year. We're gonna to go to the bottom where it says connect. And we're just gonna connect. So now this number here, this 21%, we'll format it the way we want to. And then I'm gonna just put in a target here, 22%. And we'll save it. So now I have a actual number that's connected based on a filter that I already applied using the interactive uh, filtering ability available in a Power BI report. So uh, stay tuned for more videos. Watch the follow Power BI tips on YouTube and LinkedIn for more tips and tricks on Power BI goals.